some animals are cute. Others are not. <laughs> We're counting down eight animals that may not have the looks, but have got plenty of personality. Number eight, look at the schnoz on this guy. The proboscis monkey's giant nose is actually used to attract mates. Hello, ladies. Proboscis monkeys are also excellent swimmers. They'll often leap off trees in big belly flops. Cannonball! Number seven, is this thing an animal or a vegetable? The pangolin looks like a walking artichoke, but is actually a mammal covered in scales. The scales are made of keratin, the same stuff as human hair and fingernails. Number six, this bird doesn't fly, it jogs. The cockapoo is the world's only flightless parrot, but it uses its legs and beak to climb trees. When the cockapoo needs to get down, it uses its wings to glide to the forest floor. Number five, the tapir's weirdest feature might be its trunk, which acts as an extended nose. The tapir can use its trunk to grab objects, pull leaves off branches, and pluck fruit from trees. Talk about following your nose. Number four, the Mexican axolotl is like a salamander that never grew up. This amphibian keeps the shape of a tadpole, a long fin along its back and frilly gills on top of its head. They also have amazing healing powers. They can regenerate limbs, organs, and even their own brain. Number three, this eye eye uses its unusually long middle finger to scoop out insect larvae from the inside of trees. It may look bizarre, but this primate is related to chimpanzees, apes, and even us. Just don't invite them to dinner. Number two, despite their names, naked mole rats are neither moles nor rats. They're actually related to porcupines and guinea pigs. And they're not even truly naked. Just look at those whisker-like hairs. A mole rat's incisor teeth can move on their own, working together like chopsticks. Now that's a picky eater. And number one, the skin on the Titicaca water frog looks too big for it, but there's a good use for that baggy skin. The folds and flaps allow more oxygen-rich water to pass over the frog, allowing it to stay underwater as long as it wants. Surfacing for air is so overrated. That's our pageant of weird but wonderful animals. For more fun facts, check out other episodes of Awesome 8.